What's up, you guys? Avery LR32 here. I have not said my actual YouTube name in quite some time, I feel. And, of course, everybody but me, unless you know how to pronounce it, says it wrong. It's not Avery LR32. It's Avery LR32. Yeah, I know. It's it's weird. It's it's. I made the name by mistake. Little fun fact about me. But besides that, this is... Jesus Christ. This is... What I'm going to call, as you can see in the deck screen here, uh, what the fuck Exodia, because this is an Exodia deck that came in first place playing <laughs> fucking Karibo with Appropriate Jar of Avarice. Like, this man is smoking that good good, and he said, you know what, we're going to play Exodia Locals today, we're going to kick some ass, and we're not even going to play shit like Silent Wobby, Battle Fader, Swiss Scarecrow that are strictly fucking better than DD Guide and, and Karibo. So, smash the ever-living crap out of that subscribe button so we can get to 900, and eventually 1,000 subscribers. I really do appreciate all of the support. So ladies and gentlemen, let's just go ahead and dive on into enough of all the BS. Let's go ahead and talk about this deck. So this is obviously a deep draw Exodia, the deck. Uh, let's just go ahead and go through this here and then we'll talk about some of the card choices. So we're playing three copies of DD Guide. Of course, all five pieces of the puzzle. We're playing two copies of Karibo. I can't get over that. Three copies of Santa Claus. So you can throw summon this card from your hand to your opponent's field in defense mode by tributing one monster they control. If summon this way once during the end phase of this turn, you can draw one card. So it's similar to Silent Wobby in the sense that you do not draw, your opponent draws. Remember that they're the ones that control the Santa Claus. So therefore they draw a card, but you don't care about that because you're running appropriate. Uh, for the spells, we're playing two cup of ace. Three Dark World Dealings, only two copies of Demise of the Land, one copy of Draw Fate. So if your life points are lower than your opponent's and your opponent controls a monster with the highest attack on the field, even if it's tied, reveal three card names, or th reveal three cards with different names from your deck, excuse me, place them on top of your deck in random order, then you draw a card. For the rest of this turn, after this card resolves, you cannot set spells or traps. Also, you can only activate one more card or effect. You can only activate one Draw Fate per turn. So really, ideally, what you can do is like what how Exodia is pictured. You're going to go for Exodia. You're going to activate this and grab like left leg, right arm, and right leg. Put it all three on the top in a random order and draw one to get you another piece of Exodia. You don't really care that you're locked out of other effects because you're just going to have Mystic Mind on the board anyway. Because let's be honest, this deck revolves around Mystic Mind. Uh, three Mystic Mind, one one day of peace. God, could you imagine this card was at three in today's day and age? Lord have mercy. People be stalling like crazy. We got three copies of Duality. One terraforming and then one upstart goblin. For the traps, we have three dark bribe, two jar of avarice. It's a send back any five cards in the grave except itself to draw one. It's it's not all that great, but it's another draw card. Uh, one metaverse to get to the mystic mine, and then three copies of solemn judgment because it's solemn judgment. Now for the last trap, three appropriate. So you activate only when your opponent draws a card or cards outside of either draw phase. So your draw phase or their own draw phase. After that, each time your opponent draws a card or cards outside of either draw phase, you immediately draw two. Now, this card's old as hell, so it's not going to have like a hard once per turn, or you can only have one face-up appropriate. So if you have three set, and the opponent, like let's say they draw off of one day apiece, it's going to be outside the draw phase. You can go, okay, cool, chain appropriate, chain appropriate, and then chain the third appropriate. You're drawing six cards every time that they draw outside of the draw phase. That, in theory, is fucking bananas because can you imagine even with something like dark bribe you know the opponent goes like well, okay i'm gonna get rid of the mystic mind since you don't have any protection i'm gonna like you know lightning storm it okay dark bribe have a card and now when that resolves all three of your appropriates are going to chain and if they don't pop those you're going to draw six cards and you might be thinking well avery you're playing a 42 card deck yeah but with upstart it's technically 41 and you've also got the other draw cards, so you're not really too worried about that, I feel. Now, obviously, the big elephants in the room here is why DD Guide and why Karibo? Because keep in mind with Karibo, I've seen that a lot of people have this weird idea with Karibo, which, I mean, granted, you see it in the anime and you think it it works a particular way and it doesn't, and that's fine. Like, I even had to reread Karibo. It only stops one attack. It says you can discard it, you take no battle damage, from that battle it doesn't end the battle phase it doesn't nullify all damage it's just for that one battle so if you're sitting with like a baroness and a chain ying you attack me with the chain ying and i go karibo i mean the opponent's gonna probably laugh in your face and then hit you for three thousand with the baroness if they don't negate the karibo with baroness so i don't know why this person opted to play 
Karibo, maybe just as a troll. That's the only thing I can think of. There was no side deck or extra deck listed for this uh, player, so maybe they just opted not to do any of that shit. Um, but I would definitely suggest, if you want to, like, actually troll with this deck and try it out, take out the fucking Karibos. Like, it's it's cute, but it's not actually good. Play Battle Fader, or what I prefer is Swift Scarecrow, because you just ditch it. It doesn't have to go to the grave, and just negates the attack and ends the battle phase on a quick effect. It's like Karibo, but it's just Power Crypt, and it's better. Also, Silent Wobby is strictly better than DD Guide because you have to keep in mind that you have to normal summon the DD Guide to your field first, and then when its effect activates on board, they can Valor you, they can Imperm you, whereas you can just give them Silent Wobby and then play Mystic Mine, or really what you want to do is vice versa, play the Mystic Mine and give them the Silent Wobby so that, the, you know, it doesn't activate its effects. Um, so that would be my changes because... You know, if you remember, Mystic Mind decks were originally playing DD Guide, but then Silent Wobby was just seen as a better alternative. I'm even going to take out the Karibos here because we're not we're not going to be doing this. So now your build actually looks like this, unless you opt for Battle Faders if you want the monster on the board, which you never want no fucking monsters on the board. So we're just going to take those out too. Um, anyway, back to the whole draw point. Uh, Santa Claus is another good one too because it's basically a kaiju. You tribute for one, and then when the opponent draws a card, if you've got appropriate, just off of them drawing one card, you're going to draw another six. So if you can chain a couple appropriates like all three together and draw like 12 cards like you're you're gonna get exodia pretty quick let me go ahead and do some quick shuffling here do 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 all right one two three four five that is really good uh obviously you can't do wobby and then duality because you're already special summon but three four five uh if it were me i'd probably just go mystic mind drop out the wobby and pass or if you want to risk it you can go duality and then hit Santa Claus, and then double Demise. So you could go for Demise, and then set that and pass, and hope to God that it doesn't pop, and then you can just play out the Mystic Mind once the opponent special summons. And then you're sitting with one piece of Exodia. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm doing five and not six, because if you're going second with this deck, you're probably going to lose. I'm just being honest. Uh, let's see. Two, three, four, five. So dealings to draw into the upstart you probably discard the santa claus you go upstart to draw into duality duality to hit you wobby one day and claws uh then you could go one day you both draw no damage set the demise and pass in case the opponent's dumb and special summons so it's not really a deep draw per se um if actually honestly if you think about it just based off of those couple of hands if you don't hit the appropriates these could be really fucking dead like you have to rely on mystic mind quite honestly so, anyway, I figured I would show off a couple hands. I figured I would show this thing on because it came in first place at a Locals, so it counts for something, I guess, unless just nobody showed up and they came in first place by default with Kribo, or maybe they're just fucking trolling the internet and they didn't actually play this. But if you're the winner of this deck, please explain to me how the fuck you won with this and came in first place. Did you pay people? Did you, like, give your OTBS pack away? Like... Did, did you just say, listen, here's an OTS pack, you might get an ulti, give me the win. Like, is, is that what we're doing at this Locals with Karibo? Bruh, I can't. I've seen it all. I've seen it all. Exodia with Karibo and Mystic Mine. Pfft, Konami, you need to ban this fucking card. That's that's for damn sure. And appro appropriates, too good. You draw two cards every time it draws, too good. Too strong, it's going to one. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.